Family on three! One, two, three, family! Yes, yes! 11, 12, 13, 18! They don't want 18, but I do anyway, just because it's so f***ing. We're here with a fifth year senior, Mr. Michael Manos who's uh, suffered a tragic injury. Uh, we're currently sitting at an 0-4 record. Uh, how do you think that record would be impacted if you could play? Uh, you know, if I'm going to be honest, I think we'd be 4-0. Uh, no, no, I'm just joking. No, um, <laughs> um, I definitely think I would have contributed to the team, and I think we, I would have helped out a lot, but uh, we played a lot of tough teams early on. So. What do you uh, what do you think uh, the focus should be for the group to get back? Because we can't keep going and get a 0 and 12 record. That would suck. <laughs> yeah, that would not be good for a lot of our uh, older guys uh, from their last year. But um, I think if we really come together as a team and really trust each other and do the honest work, I think the off the pitch work yeah. will contribute on the field and we'll really come together. True, I agree. Thank you to Michael Manos and uh, his knee for giving us a 0-4 record. <laughs> As always, he's late. This I'm guy. practicing, yeah? I'm out. Never on time. German efficiency is just a lie. <laughs> what can you say? What's going on with you? Join the seniors, the injury. Yeah. We got a whole crew of senior citizens just on the bench. Come on, guys, come on! You're so fast, guys. Okay. So quick. Like a jackrabbit. No cheating. Whoa. Well, I like a horse. It's so cute. Finish, Bob. Ah. Finish, Bob. Ah. Finish, Bob. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, friend. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Spanko doing no work at all. Let's go this way and I'm going to drag this with me because we're going to need a lot of that on Saturday. It's going to be a crazy game Saturday. It's going to go over our heads, land, we're going to have to travel with it and then we're going to have to run forward to get back up there. It's going to take a lot of effort and selfless running to move up the pitch on Saturday. Okay? This is Andrew Compton. How are you feeling? Feeling good, bro. Are you prepared to session, ready to destroy George? Dude, that's George wait. right there. Smash him! I don't want to say anything. I just wait till we see on. Wait till we're on the field. In the pitch, All right. right. Because you're being a little. You're being a little. I can't say the word because it's gonna be beat. <laughs> Here with uh, Nathan Huff, who made a rather magnificent sa save, if I must say so myself. Good job today in the practice. How are you feeling uh, about your chances of starting on sa Saturday against Gannon? Well, loaded question, but um, you know, I've been going at it for the last two and a half weeks, so really putting uh, put my foot down and trying to get back to where I know I can be, and I think I'm finally getting to that point. So I think it's all open, um, especially after a hard loss last week. I know there's going to be some changes, whether it's in the net, we'll have to see. But I'm hoping uh, that I can do enough to start. Yeah. What do you think are some of the changes we have to make to... So there's going to be water in the cups, all right? <laughs> <laughs> to start winning. What are... uh, I will move it. <laughs> what do you think some of the changes we have to make to start winning and turn around our season 
and get that piece of championship. I just think we have to work a little bit on um, really kind of the cooperation between the defence and midfield. Got to have someone in that pivot. I think Wolfie did a good job on um, on the weekend. I think he's the right man in that spot, but I think we just have to have those kind of changes. I know the centre-half position as well, that might be a place where we might see some changes uh, across the board. So I think really it's just kind of what works for the cohesion of the team, uh, and what makes us more positive and what makes us kind of build the play up better. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much, Nathan. <laughs> We're here with the unsung heroes, Kristen and the new athletic trainer. Introduce yourself. Nice to meet you, Macy. I hope you're going to keep us just as safe as Kristen has been keeping us. It was a great Tuesday. I'll see you tomorrow. I'm at the front bank. I'm at the front. Oh, what a great I'm angle for this. The camera. Catch up, Bobby! <laughs> Time come, time come. It's expensive. She said if you're a math and education major, come see me after the meeting. I looked her, I was like, Come on, Moritz. Yeah. Like, oh. Oh. Okay, I just have like it's a first try. position. Like, I'm just gonna say it real quick. First try. Like, like, He's got it. Right now for math education major. So I was like, I'll be honest, anything to help to you above, I cannot do. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot Woo! Be There's gonna be five of them. Four of you in the pivot. And this big space. So be careful over rotating. If they get stuck, we need you guys in the right areas. Yes, Bob, play. Jack said he loves seeing me on camera, so you're just helping him out. True. <laughs> oh no, I missed it. That's <laughs> so bad. <laughs> it's so hard to see through the camera. It's the game from the perspective of Dill. Hey Jar. Hey Jar. Jar the bear. How are you feeling? I'm feeling great. Sexy? I'm always sexy, you know. Jerry's Jerry. That is true. Fat is asked on the team. Did you get my goal? I did not. Sadly. Good man. It wasn't on film, didn't happen, you know what I mean? Well, exactly. Hi, does taste good? Ankle biter, Shetland pony, Kai Pritchard. I would like to have this Shetland pony in my backyard. <laughs> I mean, you did teach him, right? <laughs> Get pranked, nerd! <laughs> Look at the room. I know, obviously, it's tight in there with the condensed pitch, but it's the ideas, it's the movement, it's the feeling. You know, we, again, we just showed some f***ing tree getting lost in touch. Yeah, okay, I know, but get the f***ing ideas right. Fisherman's friend. For fresh breath. It's Probably. good. Some people need that in the team, actually. This car is strong. What he said. I don't think I need it, but... <laughs> <laughs> you brush your teeth every day? Every day. Twice. Two Twice. to three times a day. <laughs> two to three times a day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Good. That's important information. There's a point. Dental hygiene. hygiene. <laughs> All right. Oh, nice. This is our school, Seaton Hill, on top of the hill. Our cafeteria is over there. Fresh color. Could I'll have a plantain. Two scoops of rice, please. Great. You want some sauce, Yeah, green sauce. Yep. Is this weird from us? A bit weird for us to do this one. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, slap me up, he's a nom. Mm-hmm. <laughs> there are the Norwegian lads enjoying their food. Flercher again. Aaron. 
I'm not banging. What up, Jim? How you doing? Ooh. Look at him eating all healthy and stuff, huh? With the vegetables. Why? Yeah. Why would you get this? This is so bland. Now I have to eat it. Mad on force. <laughs> Dead ass plate. Show the tooth. Show the tooth. For the video. Do it for the video. That's a bamboo leaf. <laughs> <laughs> if you eat that, you get like special like... Show them the two, come on. Just small ones. Powers. Real quick, the quick ones. Come on. Hey, like super fast. Three. On, yes! <laughs> Alright lads, what's the, what's the best day in the calf? Best day? Curry chicken. Curry, uh, what is it, Wednesday? Curry Wednesday. Curry Wednesday, I don't eat it to calf, so if I'm eating, you know. Mm -hmm. Curry chicken is such a good day of the league, actually. I love it. <laughs> He's got a better hairline. Him <laughs> or Breeze? <laughs> hey, Breeze! Breeze! Hey, Breeze! Is that peace? There he is. Oh my god! Oh my god! It's Jake Trapanato! <laughs> <laughs> well, we are vloggers. Moritz and Elias on yeah. tour. On tour. I don't know if we're in the camera, but could be. Explain to me what you're having, Luke. Yeah. <laughs> Couldn't tell you. <laughs> More mm -hmm. What is it? It's just a mess. A mess? Mm -hmm. It's not a mess. Where does this like dish in, uh, originate uh, from? Hey, what happened in the uh, it's like Turkey. Uh, Turkey? Uh, George, is that right? What are you saying, man? What is this? Is that pita bread? It is. Kebab. This is kebab. <laughs> this is gyro. This is gyro. What kebab? Gyro. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So, give us a wave, huh? So stable, man. <laughs> oh, yeah. The beautiful Michael Manos. You already know, baby. So, basically, what we got here is the beauty and the beast. <laughs> I did not think this. <laughs> that was right on my nutsack. That was a most. I'm missing the Robert's Hey! It's not there. In the two years I haven't been around, I've seen you get bigger in the stomach. <laughs> Shit, you right? Ooh, let's go, Angelos! Yeah! So far, That's in the air. I don't know why. Yes! We are. Where are we, David? We're in Mora 228. What are we doing here? We got the academic all stars here. <laughs> Studying away, learning, educating themselves, <laughs> becoming better people. Mm -hmm. Good stuff going on, big thing thing. Who do you think are going to be here for the rest of the year? Hmm. Well, Mike's off the pretty start right now. He's the, he's the resident senior. Well, okay. how, d how did you make it here as a senior? It's because of my internship. Yeah, sure. Well, you have 
Huh? What do you have in the class? My grade is fixed, but when I printed my grades, it was a like 20%. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's in a rough spot. The special ed kid over here. What's he doing? He's watching a TV show. Study all? F*** that. Look at Nevlin. Yeah. Huh? Look at her. Healthy. Yeah. Get, studying get hard. Get food, Before you study. So, have you decided on a, on a major yet? Yeah, I'm a psychology major. Psychology? Yeah. So what... What does that mean? You're gonna... That means I'm gonna read your brain. Damn. Yeah, everybody behind the camera, too. Yeah. Oof. Watch out, people behind the camera. Mm -hmm. Nevlin's yeah. coming for you. Who are we playing this weekend? Ghana. Do we love them? Uh, no, I think they're our rivals. Yeah, Apparently. they are. I already beat them once this season. <laughs> True. Them, so, we're gonna make it two, two uh, wins in a row. You know? Yeah, let's go, Nevlin. I'm here with our captain, George. <laughs> Where have we been right now? We took uh, our new cameraman, Elias Wangen, to the hospital because apparently he doesn't have enough blood in his system. <laughs> Trying to figure out what he needs uh, <laughs> to get healthy so he can play finally this season, senior year of college. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, going back, time to go back, do some rehab and get ready for Ghana tomorrow. What's today, Nev? Today is Jersey Day, and I have a Liverpool jersey on. Nice, yeah, Nevlin. So. Nice, Nevlin. I had to match George. Yeah, that's it. What's up, Jerry? You wear it? Yeah. How are you? I'm good, man. Wilf! Yeah? Talk to us about your thoughts behind the haircut, mate. Uh, uh, a, my thoughts were, right? Yeah. What are you going to think if you're a Ghana midfielder coming up against this <laughs> You can't say words me. like that. We're going to have to beep. Right. Yeah. That water is a smart guy. Yeah. So is that your whole idea? Like, what what's yeah. the Ghana going to think when they see you? Yeah, basically, if you're going to get to 50-50 with this guy, uh -huh. you're going to be struggling. Right? Hey, so you don't think they're going to make fun of you? Like... They can make fun of you when they want. Okay. Right? okay. okay. Yeah, it's just a piece of game, man. <laughs> well, they're two miles away from each other. So if we let it up to Ben. Where's your jersey, Max, man? Come on, son. I wasn't wearing a tough, skin tight one. <laughs> fair, fair. Compton's got the baddie jersey. I love it. Shona! You beauty. Right, Has to be the pretty, prettiest jersey here. Wales is big English. Harry Maguire would start at uh, United States midfield. He would. He actually would. It's not very nice. The Queen's dead. All right, Georgie, come on. <laughs> You're trying to progress it. Hopefully, this is a recognizable pattern of the one on one. Okay? I don't care what you do to make the overload. As long as you find your attacker's feet, you guys can do what you want. Essentially, it's going to be a full back, a pivot, and a center back. If the pivot and the full back want to jump into that box, that's fine, okay? Because it's about the ideas, it's about the movement, trying to play through, get on the other side. Once you get into this box, you're looking to play the ball into here. Only one of you can go and add, okay? Woo! All right! Come on, Mikey! Oh my god! 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 Oh my
Oh my <laughs> Imagine being in Gannon midfielder. Don't make out the thumbnail, it'd be f***ing terrifying. Well, my legs might drop with this. Here's the thumbnail. Hit the thumb. <laughs> <laughs> Tomorrow, alright? Uh, new grey. Is that the only one that's clean? Yeah. It's new grey. Alright, new grey for warm ups, alright? Hey, first piece of game for a lot of you, okay? Family on three! One, two, three, family! Whenever you do things today, you've got to be so certain because this game is such a fine margin today. It will be one moment, I think, that will determine this game if everyone's doing their jobs. And I say that over years and looking at their results this year and looking at how they play this year. One goal in it, everywhere they go. Everywhere they go. So the game today, our focus, is not about how many moments can I create, it's about how many small, again, how many small wins can I make to keep this game tight, to keep this game to give us a chance. I'm telling you, if the moment happens today, it will come to you. It will come to you. You haven't got to go and do something crazy to make it happen. Listen up, lads. Look, I just, uh, I think I put it in the email, you know, it was a solid week's training. Uh, just kind of just general atmosphere. And I just thought we approached the game in the right way. It was probably the most team performance, team feeling, team changing room, team warm-up, and team half-time, and 
even when we're out there, you're reminding each other of the right things, the things we talked about at halftime. You know, it's uh, it must it must feel good for you. I mean, it's, it was a pleasing week for sure, and we've got more work to do tomorrow. But I can't reiterate the team aspect well enough. I think it's epitomised by you know how much like Wolfie's clearance off the line. It's just that. It's that it, it's that kind of feeling. It really felt like the investment in each other. Like you got beat but I won't let you down and I won't make him look like a mug out of you and I've got your back in. Uh, honestly the cameos that came on, Luki Art Linden brilliant up there. Isaac's first game at right back was brilliant back there. Yeah, Spencer right, George right. held us down. I think it extends beyond yeah, that. I think it extends beyond <laughs> that. You know, I said to Mace the other day, and he came up to me and said, Mace, you need to be more of an animal in training. And the last two days he has been non stop pressing people, wanting to win the ball, and that just makes everyone a little bit sharper. And that just makes the team better. To be on a losing streak, to go and get a point against a really good team and Career. the way we did it, you know, and from a couple of times it was scrappy, but I think we've missed that in games. We've missed that doggy fight, we've down. missed that scrap in us. And I think we found a little bit tonight, and I feel like this should be the first step of, not that we have the lead now, it's like almost like the first step of like, yeah, okay, it is in there, we have, we have got it, and now we just preach the same things we've been preaching even though when we're losing. Things don't change, even though that changed. We're still pushing in the same way we are. So, but the uh, really boys, the spirit team. Stop boys. <laughs>